what's happening on the 27th of May up in Blanche Shares. And this morning, I want to welcome the chairman and director of North Coast Jazz, Mr. Louis Leasing, and artist Chris Ann Joseph, who will be performing at the show. Yeah. Uh, they're joining us on set this morning to chat a little bit about it and to give away tickets. So get ready to give us a call at 6224010. There's one ticket we're giving away, right? One ticket. One ticket. All right, just making sure. Good morning, Mr. Leasing. How are you? Good morning. <laughs> or rockers. I don't want to take it. I don't want to take it. How are you doing this morning? Never better. Tell me, what was the, the, uh, the impetus to start the, the North Coast Jazz? I'm a resident of Blanche Shares. I have, really? a, I have a home there. Okay, okay. And uh, when you ride through the community, you see that the community is in need of independence, i.e., it's a community of a population of approximately 15 to 1,700 residents. Mm -hmm. But we have seven shops, stroke rum shops. We have a fishing depot, mm -hmm. and we have one small hotel and a couple of guest houses. When children pass for SEA, mm -hmm. most of them migrate from the community. <clears throat> right. Because not many may end up going to Blanche Shares. Right. And so the question is, how do we sustain this community? Will it forever be a place of, of uh, as it were, migrants, people leaving the, co the mm -hmm. community? And so we felt that we had to find a way to create an industry, to create a destination, because Blanche Shares has all the, the ingredients to be a, a powerful destination, tourist destination, mm -hmm. both local and international. We have 13 beaches. We have tremendous hiking and nature trails. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> it's the jump off point to places, to the inaccessible beaches like Paria and what have you. Yeah. Waterfalls, etc., etc. The people up there could cook real sweet and. That I would agree with 100%. And when you add it all up, we felt that, look, let's create a destination here. Mm -hmm. And so working with the Blanche Shares Community Council, we came up with the idea for the North Coast Jazz. Right. Sometimes you need an event to create the destination. Okay. The plan was to create a bed and breakfast industry so that ordinary common folk would become independent. And I, I, I say it all the time. I say whenever crumbs are being shared in Port of Spain, not even the dust from the crumbs is sent to places like Blanche Shares. <clears throat> okay, so you took it upon yourself to say, all right, you're going to assist this bed and breakfast business, but we're also going to assist the community by putting on this festival in, in May. It's jazz, jazz season, as we've been calling it. But we, we, didn't, we, we, were, we were there before they had this Before there was jazz a jazz season. season. Because yeah. I remember hearing about North Coast jazz, and it was always this thing up in the bush somewhere. That's what I used to hear about it, is this thing up in the bush, in Blanche Shares. Um, so how has it evolved over the years? Well, in year one, mm -hmm. we had 21 rooms. 21 people had a bed and breakfast. Right. Because we had to sell the idea and get people to do it. Of course. Last year, two years after COVID, we had 107 rooms spread across the North Coast. Nice. So that is not only Blanche Shares is benefiting from the concept, but the other villages, La Filette, Las Cuevas, etc. Mm -hmm. It is really a model for development. Right. Um, if you focus on some of the big festivals in the world, the New Orleans Jazz Festival. When the New Orleans Jazz Festival is being convened and held in, in New Orleans, you can't get a hotel room. Mm -hmm. And they got plenty of hotels. Mm -hmm. But I mean, it's similar to what we have already when we talk about Tobago Jazz Festival, when we talk no, about no. Carnival, for example. Uh, well, Tobago should be doing far better than they're doing with the kinds of monies that they're getting. Because... You see, you're going to get into a whole no, other no, conversation. No, no, no. Forgive me, but I'm, being, I'm a very, very straightforward and forthright person. I know. Yeah? I know. And so my own argument is that the state should be doing more to help communities like Blanche Shares by right. way of support to events like Blanche Shares. Okay. Because this is the t turtle watching season, mm -hmm. so there's that possibility. The hiking trails, the kayaking on the, on the Marianne River, and the list goes on and on. Of course. It's the ideal place to come. The only thing that is missing is the rooms. I want to say to you, we sent a proposal to the government mm -hmm. asking them to set up uh, a soft loan window of $49 million. Because if you were going to spend $7 billion in, in sandals, you could spend a little measly $49 million in Blanche shares to create 200 rooms. Right. That's all we are asking you to do. 
So we are working on that in the anticipation that once we have the rooms, all the other things will follow. We'll, get, we'll start a dance company, a drama company, so people will be entertained during the week, on the weekends while they're there. But we may just produce a Hamilton. You know about Hamilton? Of course I know about right. Hamilton. That's all I see. Um, all right, so tell me about what's happening at the North Coast Jazz Festival. Who is on the show this year? What can we expect? Well, we have this great man, for starters. <laughs> but we have Duvon Stewart. Right. Because the festival focuses not only, let me say the tagline of the festival is born here, played here. So many people who have come to Blanche Shares have grown, gone on to become mainstay artists all over Trinidad mm -hmm. and Tobago and the world. Mm -hmm. um, we have Stacey Sobers, we've got Mongal Patisar, we've got Marvin Newton, I told you this great man here, Christian Joseph, and Nisa. In, in more ways than one, we've got a cast that will make anybody happy. Brass to the World is featuring both Ronnie McIntosh and Super Blue, and they'll be doing some jazz. Ronnie McIntosh and Super Blue doing jazz. That's enough to sell me the whole show right there. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I want you to win a ticket to go to this. 622 That's the number to call if you want to win yourself a ticket for the North Coast Jazz. Chris on Joseph is here as well. Chris on, what can we expect from you, especially at this North Coast Jazz? Good morning, everyone. Um, what to expect from me is interaction i love to to, to give the, the audience a treat so it's not i mean I, I think i sing fairly well but i'm not it's not just about me coming to sing some songs i really want to interact with people have people enjoy what's happening we're gonna play some um you know i, I love calypso so we're always gonna well, we're always gonna have some calypso <laughs> on, on the on the agenda right but and we're I mean, gonna, we're gonna jazz, really for them. Yeah, Calypso yeah, and Jazz yeah, have yeah, that, that close friends. linkage already. So we have somebody on the phone line ready to win a ticket. Good morning to you. Good morning. Welcome to the show. How are you doing this morning? I am good. Where are you calling us from? From the little village of Las Bajo. Um, this is at uh, Palo Seco. Okay. Good place. So, good place, Palo Seco. Yeah. You want to come all the way up the road to Blanche Shares. Nice. That's how I can come oh, yeah. in for the whole weekend. Oh, yes, oh, yes. That is what we're talking about. Mr. Lee Singh, you have a question for us, Owen? Tell me two artists who will be on the cast. I just mentioned it. I think it's um, Stacey Sobers and. Um, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I would not show the second. Um, it's a strange name. I'm not sure if another artist. Get something and wave. Get something and wave. Get something and wave. Get something and wave. Is that um, Come on. That was a giveaway then. Yes, yes. Is that um? Oh gosh, your name is just coming to me. Um, is that um? <laughs> Blue Blue Boy. Well, that used to be his name, but his name is now. Um. Super, super, Come on, man. super. <laughs> all right, you, you, that's your call. Yes, why yes? not? Yes, all right. <laughs> it's your call, Louis. So if it's Palaseco, it's we're going Palaseco. We're going to that way, boy. That is by us. All right, so all the live will be Palaseco, and you'll take your information off here. Congratulations, you're going to North Coast Jazz on the 27th of May up in Blanchichez. And how much are tickets to get to this for people who don't um who don't win the tickets? Five hundred dollars only. Only. Nice. And you know, so I, when I say to people, convening, hosting, planning, putting on a show mm -hmm. in far off Blanche Shares as they think, but mm -hmm. Blanche Shares is really one hour and 15 minutes from the Mount Coco Road in Maraval. Right. My driving, and I don't drive fast. Right. The putting on a show and an event out in Blanche Shares. It's almost four times the cost of putting on a show in Port of Spain. Of course, that makes sense because the transport alone. But uh, I want to, of course, give us a little taste of what is expected at the North Coast Jazz coming up on the 27th of May in the form of Mr. Crisson Joseph. Crisson, take us to the break with a beautiful rendition, won't you? I was growing no small fat. <laughs> Let me kick my apology. Ragging me by 
Rock fuck it work a white vest27th of May, and clearly there's a taste of what is to come. It's going to be a fantastic event. Thank you so much, gentlemen, for joining us this morning, and all the best on the 27th of May. Thank you, Rocker. No problem. Enjoy your day. <laughs> <laughs> Let's take a quick break and come back with more inside the show. We have one more performance still to come, and you never know, you might get some tickets for this one too. <laughs> I, I ain't sure about that. <laughs>